Hi, this is Daniel Del Pozo with Worthy Real Estate and Call DDP Real Estate. I'm a local real estate agent here in Las Vegas, Nevada, but I can actually help you worldwide need be. Today, we're taking a look at the spectacular home here at 5045 North Bonita Vista. This home is on a half acre lot, but offers a lot of options. I wanted to start out front here because there are so many things. One, we have fantastic curb appeal, great landscaping, and then off to one side, we have a private driveway that actually goes to the next gen suite that has a full kitchen and everything that we're gonna take a look at. And the other side has not only a fantastic amount of parking, there's a gate that goes through to more parking and an entire shop with a garage. There's already a two car garage over here, but we also have more space in the back and a great backyard. So let's go take a look. For this home, I'd like to start with the casita. It's a pretty awesome option that's attached to the home that you have a real full blown living area for next gen as people like to have in homes these days. So you have an entire living room here. You have a driveway, a custom gate, a little patio. There's even a side garden area for the casita as well. And you have pretty much a full blown kitchen. Other than a dishwasher, you have a sink, range, over the range microwave, refrigerator. So it's a very livable space and a good amount of space for what it is. And then down the hall here, we actually have a full bedroom. So you got a bedroom, there's two kind of reaching closets there and you got a nice natural light coming in. We have a full bathroom. So you got your vanity, you have a shower tub combo. So it's all right here, whether this is an entertaining space or somebody is living here and a little bonus space. The previous owner was using this as kind of a workout room, but it'd be a great little office. Could be another workout room, knitting room, whatever you want and access to outside. So a great thing about this particular home is that you have like 15 ways to get outside. So from the casita, you have direct access to this amazing covered patio. So there's a lot of space back here. It's a nice covered patio. You have wiring for a fan or a light. And then look at all the space that's out on the actual yard. So we have tons of pavers and within the yard, you have a little gazebo area off to the side there. We have a wood burning fire pit in the ground here. Put some seats around that. It'd be really nice in the fall time, winter time here in Las Vegas. And then you have a lot of space back here. If you wanted to put a pool, there is the ability to do that. And you also have a back area here that could be a garden. I think it'd be a great spot for horseshoes, bocce balls, something of that nature. And then it actually leads over to this side of the yard that not only is manicured very well, you have a little cactus and things of that nature. There is a little foot washing station here. So if uh, kids are playing outside or anybody's playing outside, or if you do end up with a pool, you have a place to wash there. Also it can be a good place to hose down a dog because you do have a fire hydrant here for Rover to go where he needs to go. So that's kind of cool. And then we'll take a look at the shop slash garage that's attached right here to the backyard. Now, the way this garage is laid out, you could use it as a traditional garage, but it also could be a play space. It could be partitioned, but as is, it can be set up as a shop. You do have some things that are specific to working on vehicles. So there's a couple of jacks on the walls for air compressors. You do have some mounts on the floor as well. They did add AC to the back door here, which is nice. There's some fans. It's an insulated garage door. Uh, you also have a pull down compressor line here for some air. So it's really nice, but as is, two cars can fit this way and then you can fit up to six cars if you're creative. Now inside the home, right off of where that casita entrance is, because it has its own lock from inside the home and right next to where the laundry room is, there's great storage inside of there. And here's where the two other bedrooms are other than the primary. So we have bedroom number one off to the front here, good amount of space, you got vaulted ceilings. It actually has a three quarter bath built into it and access to outside as well. And then we have a full bathroom here on the hallway, a little bit of a linen closet. And then we have the traditional bedroom over there in the back of the house. That'd be great for a kid's room. Any Think of that nature it does have some great paint in there uh, currently. Then the heart of the home, we kind of have two living room spaces, so we'll get to the other side in a moment, but here, tons of space. So we have a gas fireplace. It's actually flanked by some great lighting here. And then we have where the dining room space is. There's even a little nook by the double doors going outside there. That could be a little office space or something of that nature. You have an entire wet bar here. So you have a working sink and you have a little drink chiller, wine chiller there. Then we have this great peninsula with the granite countertops, good sized kitchen, tons of storage, plus the pot shelves up top. You have pantry space over here as well. Uh, and then, this living room actually adjoins to, let's call it a family room, but it really, it's a almost the exact same amount of space. There was a pool table and a couple other fun things in there. So it could be a game room, could be a hangout room, could be the kid's space. It could be just something that gives you some partition from the living space here. Cause you have so much square footage in this house, just under 3000 square feet. That's the access to the two car garage right there. And then we have the primary suite. 
So the primary suite also takes advantage of the vaulted ceilings. Uh, we have a design where there is a great walk-in closet. It's custom in there, tons of drawers, places to hang things. It's a great design overall. And you have a very wide door to get in there, which is nice. Then the primary bathroom has these kind of double doors, makes it elegant to get into. Another way to get outside from inside the home, you have your dual vanity, and then a custom shower and soaking tub right here up against the granite wall, which makes it not only look beautiful, but it's a nice space to be in because you can see outwards into the room. So this house is currently listed on the market for $879,900. You're sitting on just about a half acre lot, just under 3,000 square feet. You have four bedrooms, four bathrooms. The next gen suite casita that's attached to it is a nice addition with a full kitchen inside of it, which is really nice. You have like 20 ways to get outside from this house, which just, it makes the flow really nice, especially if you're entertaining or if you have friends and family that like to come in and out. You have a fantastic backyard that's attached to not only a fantastic driveway with a lot of space, but you have that shop back there so it can be whatever you want, but it also can be extra storage for your vehicles. And you have the attached two car garage already. So it has a great amenities like that. This house has a great flow and the location is fantastic. We're kind of out here in the Lone Mountain, Northwest side of town of Las Vegas. And it has great access to not only all the amenities out here on this side of town, but you can get onto the freeway and pop into town very quickly. I'd like to thank Rochelle Dolan, also with Worley Real Estate, for allowing me to shoot this property. My name is Daniel DePozo with Worley Real Estate and Call DDP Real Estate. I'll see you at the next house.